In this video, I'm going to show you how to use tubular bind off to cast off your 1x1 one one rib. If you have 2x2 two two rib, you're going to first have to transition it into 1x1 one one rib. So I have this little sample here. That is the last stitch. First, we're going to have to cut the yarn. You're going to leave about four times as long as your work is wide. So I'm going to cut here. And then get your needle. So first, I need to pull my stitches to the tip of my needle. So I'm going to pull my cable like this. I'm going to place a stitch marker in the first two stitches. This is for when we come back around, we can find the first two stitches. So there are only two steps that we need to repeat. Step one. When the first stitch on the needle is a knit stitch, we're going to go through the first stitch knitwise, drop it off, skip the second stitch, and go through the third stitch purlwise. Step two. When the first stitch is a purl stitch, we're going to go through the first stitch purlwise, drop it off, and then go through the third stitch knitwise. But we're going to first come between the second and the third stitch from the back, and then we go through the third stitch knitwise. And that's it! Only two steps. So let's do that again. First stitch is a knit stitch. Go through the first stitch knitwise, drop it off. Skip second stitch, go through the third stitch purlwise, pull through. Step two, the first stitch is a purl stitch. Go through the first stitch purlwise, drop it off. Come between the second and third stitch and then knit the third stitch. Go through the third stitch knitwise. Okay, so this is how I remember it. Knit one, purl three. And then purl one, knit three. If you can do this all together, do that knit three, knit one, purl three, and purl one, knit three. But if you can't do it all together, you can go through two and three first, and then knit the third stitch. Knit stitch, so knit one, purl three. Purl one, knit three. Knit one, purl three. Purl one, knit three. Okay, now I have two stitches left on the needle. I'm going to pull the stitch marker up so I can find the first two stitches and I'm going to put these two stitches on the needle as well. So I'm going to borrow my yarn needle to help place the first two stitches. And we can do that one last time. Knit one, purl three. 
purl one, knit three, and then take the stitches, two stitches off the needle and the stitch marker as well. And then all you need to do left is weave in this tail to the wrong side. And then we have this nice and neat tubular bind off.